Jeunesse family, do you feel empowered and ready to lead? I can tell you these events are so invigorating, so re-energizing for me. Do you feel re-energized? Do you feel invigorated? Are you passionate about Jeunesse? I want to give a special thank you to all the speakers that uh, graced the stage this weekend. Incredible value. Would you agree that you learned something this weekend? Would you agree that you learned a few somethings this weekend? You know, I look at these events and just, I talked about experiences. And these are, these are the experiences that I feel so fortunate to create with Jeunesse and um, feel so blessed to have such incredible leaders in this company. But when I look around the room today, I see all the future leaders of Jeunesse. If you didn't have the opportunity of being on this stage this weekend, that's something you should set as a goal. We've got um, a very important moment here today with Jeunesse and Asia Pacific. The timing is now. Do you feel the timing? Are you ready, ready to really leverage this weekend? I talked about the importance of leverage. You have to leverage the timing. We have to utilize this event to go out there and touch more people's lives. Do you believe that Jeunesse is a gift that we have to share with the world? Yes. I'm asking you again, do you believe that Jeunesse is a gift that you have to share with the world? Yes. So it's our responsibility to get out there and touch more people's lives, talk to more people, leverage this event, leverage all the knowledge that you gain and put it to practice. You know, these events are empowering on so many levels, but when I look around the room today, I just see mass potential. I see so much potential. All of you put a priority on today, put a priority on this weekend to get out here and really soak up the knowledge and put it to practice and learn from some of the great leaders in this company. And I can tell you, I sit there backstage and I watch every leader and it makes me so proud to see you know, I talk about the personal development component of network marketing, and it makes me so proud and really humbled to see just how our leaders get better and better. I pride myself, and I hope all of you pride yourselves, on being a student of this industry. You can learn something new in this business and in life every single day. You can get better every single day. And I just want to congratulate all the speakers for bringing tremendous value and for getting better. Every single event, I look at these diamonds, some of the rubies that were on stage, and they just get better and better at delivering value to all of you. So I hope that you took a lot of great information, a lot of great knowledge was soaked up, and that you apply it to your businesses, because the time is now. Now, many of you remember yesterday before lunch, we had set a goal for this weekend, and partnering with the local charity, the Malaysian Indigenous People Youth Council. And, um, you know, it's been a, a very special weekend and I want to thank all of you for your contributions, certainly to this very worthy cause and everything we're going to be able to do to support the village here in Malaysia. And I'm really proud that we had, you know, we had the top tier, $1,500 for our top supporters to join me here on stage. And before I welcome them to stage, we talk about, I spoke about it yesterday during my opening speech, um, servant-driven leadership, having a servant's heart. And every single one of these leaders that are about to join me on this stage truly exemplify servant-driven leadership. They're here to serve you. They have caring hearts. A common theme that I felt this weekend was heart, was love. I always talk about our competitive advantage being the heart of this company. And I feel so much love. And that's a beautiful thing. And why we talk about Jeunesse being a movement is because we're bringing together like-minded, like-hearted people with a common mission, a unified vision to create positive impact in the world. And I feel the love. I feel the heart. Do you feel the heart of this company? Yes. Do you love Jeunesse? Yes. Are you proud to represent this company? Yes. We're proud to have you representing this company. I believe that all of you are the leaders of the future. So with that, I want to welcome all of our top contributors to the stage to join me. And uh, if we can give them a, a definite warm uh, round of applause for their contributions. We've got, you know, tons of leaders that are going to join me on this stage and want to give them a special thank you. So all of our top contributors, please join me up on the stage and we give you a very huge thank you for your support. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Aces Worldwide, Young Diamond Director, Helen Chang, Double Diamond Director, George Hunter, Double Diamond Director, Giraffe Kusumukon, and Inawan Prajogo, Double Diamond Directors, Anusara Chandranzi, and Tanen Wongsa, Double Diamond Around the world, and I start to notice a very common theme, is that we're having 
a lot of the same people joining me on this stage. And what that shows me and really speaks to my heart is that these people really feel the heart of this company. They really see our mission as far as creating positive impact in the world and helping children all the world, around the world through Jeunesse Kids. And it really touches my heart to see all of you continue to support the cause and um, really the heart and soul of everything we're doing with Jeunesse. So thank you all. Let's give them one more round of applause. And um, now before we announce if we were able to hit our goal of $37,500, $37,500. I'd like to welcome back to the stage the president of the Malaysian Indigenous People Youth Council, Alan, as well as the chief of the village and some very special guests from our village here in Malaysia. Let's give them a warm Jeunesse welcome. Come on, guys. family we were able to hit that goal. We want to thank all of you for your support. Alan, this comes from all of our, from the bottom of all of our hearts. I'd like to, to take a photo here with all of our diamonds and leaders that contributed. I don't know how to say thank you to all donors, to all who participate. Thank you Scott Lewis, thank you Chris Cooper, thank you Keith. Thank you, John Payne, Christy, uh, Risa Tung, if I correctly pronounce his, uh, her name. <laughs> uh, thank you to all donors. Thank you so much, Jakey's. Thank you so much, Jeunesse family. <laughs> I, I'm still shaking with <laughs> I can't believe that you guys make it for us. Uh, I, 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 I just want to say thank you and I hope that this, you guys already give us a lot. You give us the opportunity to change our village, our community. And I, I hope that one day we can repay back all your good, uh, good deeds, is it? Yeah. Uh, thank you so much. And I will give the mic to the... Um, uh, one of the representatives to speak on our behalf. Hello, apa kabar sabu? Saya mengucapkan terima kasih kerana membantu kami. Sekian terima kasih. Again, want to thank you for your contributions. I mean, these events are so inspiring for me. To be able to see all of you pour your hearts into Jeunesse, it's something that I can't even put into words because there's so many deals out there, there's so many other companies, but what's lacking really is the heart, the heart and soul of this company, and that's all of you. And when I get to travel the world and attend these events, I get to really get inspired, you know, because your success stories, your growth, your passion, would inspire me every single day. When I wake up to that alarm and it says make today count, what inspires me is all the life-changing story, all the people's lives that we're able to touch through Jeunesse. And I'm so grateful for your leadership, for your dedication, for your trust and commitment to what we're trying to do to create one of the great legacy companies of this industry. And that's what it's all about. You know, that's been our focus from the start. We never wanted to just create a billion dollar company because there's so much more to it than creating a billion dollar company. It's, um, it's always been to create a household name, to create a movement. We're able to change hundreds of thousands of lives around the world. And that's the power of what you guys have with Jeunesse. And I'm so proud of what we've created. I'm proud of the culture. Are you proud of the culture that we have with Jeunesse? Yes. Are you proud to be a part of this family? Yes. You know, this is a culture of family, integrity, Values, un unity, purpose, passion, those are the words that come to my mind 
Are you passionate about Jeunesse? Yes. I talk about this company standing for what's right. I believe that because this is a company that was founded based on the right principles, the right values. And when I look around the room today, you know, I spoke about this last night. We had the opportunity of celebrating with our Sapphire elites and above at the Star Gala last, last night. And I spoke about, you know, my vision's never been a billion dollar company. It's been to create a household name, a legacy company in this industry, a generational movement that can be passed on generation to generation. Top five companies in the industry, that's what they've created. So when I looked around the room last night and when I look around the room today, you know, I've often spoke about having a 30 year run in me. 30 year run in me. That's a long time. But, um, you know, I look around the room and I just see potential. I look around the room and I see pioneers. We're just eight years young. Yeah, we've had three consecutive billion dollar years, but I believe we're the smallest billion dollar company on the planet. Why? Because we have so many markets that are just babies, so many markets around the world that are just scratching the surface of their potential. I look around Asia Pacific, all the way from North Asia and in Korea, and down to, you know, over in the Pacific and Australia, Southeast Asia, Indonesia, Philippines, Singapore, Malaysia, Thailand, all these markets are still just babies. To create a billion dollar market, we're going to need basically all of those markets to be doing over $10 million a month. That's the vision. That's the potential of what we have. And all of you have the power in your hands. All of you are the pioneers of this movement. And I've always spoken about Chines being a movement. We never experience momentum in this company because momentum is this finite period. Creating a movement is something that's generational. It's something that will last many, many years to come. There's so much potential out there. And when I look in the room, all I see is potential. Do you believe that you have the potential for great things in Jeunesse? Yes. Do, you have, do you believe that you have the potential to touch people's lives through this company? Yes. If everybody can stand up for one moment, because I really want you to, to feel the pride of what we represent in Jeanette's. I want you to realize the power of what you have in your hands with this company. So when I ask you, when I say you can, I want to hear you say I will. And what I mean by that is you will get out there and continue to change thousands of people's lives. That you will get out of your comfort zone. That you will leverage this event. That you will leverage all the knowledge that you gain. That you will go back to phase one and launch your business. It's constantly launching your business. That's what this industry is all about. There's going to be things that get lost along the way. People are going to lose their focus. But all of you made a priority to be here today. All of you are here for a reason. And all of you are the future leaders that are going to lead this company in this region to the top. Do you believe that? Yes. So when I say you can, I want to hear you say, I will. Three, two, one, you can. I will. You can. I will. You can. I will. Thank you. Now I want you to feel that passion. I want you to feel that fight until I reach and fulfill those dreams. But you have to let your dreams be bigger than your fears. We all know fear. Fear creeps up from time to time. You've got to let your dreams be so big that you conquer fear every single day. You have to let your action be bigger than your words. I talked about walking the walk. Don't just talk the talk. Lead by example. Don't just dream your dreams. Live your dreams. And that's the potential. That's what we see happening all around the world with Jeunesse. People living their dreams. Maximizing. Fulfilling their potential. Now... You know, my dreams are extremely big, as I said, and I'm really passionate about fulfilling those dreams. And, you know, I, I believe that this company is just destined for greatness. And I have believed that since the first day before we ever held our first pre-launch call. I'll never forget that day. But, um, you know, I'm, I'm reminded of a quote and said, when you're truly passionate about something, you don't have to be pushed. The vision pulls you. The vision pulls you every single day. And I feel so fortunate and so blessed to be able to wake up every morning, 5.15 a.m., and I don't go into the office and call it a job. I go into the office and call it my passion. And I feel so blessed to be able to have that opportunity. I know many of you share the same passion. That's why we call this One Jeunesse Family. Jeunesse is my life, just like it's your life. We live this company. We don't have hobbies. We don't have side projects. We live and breathe this company. It's all we talk about. It's all we know and why. It's because all of you, I talked about your stories are what really inspire us. 
I believe that Jeunesse has allowed me to really identify my calling in life, and that's to serve all of you. And that's one of our cultural attributes for all of the Jeunesse corporate family. When they join this company, when we hire people, one of our cultural attributes is having a servant's heart. We never forget that the only way we've had success with this company is through leaders like yourself. We will never forget that. We'll never create three consecutive billion dollar years if it weren't for all of you sharing our passion, sharing our mission, believing in our vision, believing in yourself. You know, I believe that we are on a run to two billion dollars and beyond. I talked about three consecutive billion dollar years. Think about how many lives we've changed. I talked about Think about how many lives we're going to be able to touch taking this company from $1.3 billion last year to $2 billion plus to $3 billion a year. My vision has always been crystal clear. I was always raised playing sports and they told me that second place is the first loser. The only thing I know is to be the best. The, every single morning I wake up and I'm never satisfied. A lot of company owners and executives, they have this kind of success. They get complacent. They get comfortable. They forget about what got them to where they are today. We'll never lose sight of that. But my vision is crystal clear for this company. And many of you have seen this slide that I've shown it many times before. But my vision isn't to be the second best company. It's to create the number one company in network marketing worldwide. And to get there, we're going to have to take this movement, movement to doing $10 billion a year. It's not going to happen next year. It may not happen the year after that. But we are in this to win this. We are in this to make Jeunesse the largest company in the entire industry. Do you believe that we can do it? Yes. Do you believe that we can make Jeunesse the number one company in network marketing worldwide? Yes. I say that on this stage with conviction because I believe with all my heart that that's what we're creating. One of the great legacy companies of this industry. And if you take that passion that you feel today, and you get out there and you leverage this event, you talk to more people, you get outside your comfort zone, remember that passion, energy, is infectious. It's infectious. Our most successful markets today, it comes from energy, it comes from enthusiasm. Passion is, is absolutely infectious. And to be successful, your attitude is more important than your ability. Your attitude, how you lead, how you talk to others. If you speak to others with excitement and conviction and belief and passion, people can feel that. People want to be aligned with leaders like yourself that have that kind of passion. All starts with your mindset. Your mindset. You heard some of our leaders spoke, uh, speak about that this weekend. And, um, you know, your mindset is so important in this industry. It's a big topic. You could speak hours about it, but really what it comes down to is belief. Am I right? It's belief. It's belief in this company. It's belief in this industry. How many of you are proud to be professional network marketers? Everyone should raise their hands because if you're not proud to represent this industry, you're not going to be successful. You have to believe in the power of network marketing. You have to believe in this company, believe in our mission, believe in our products. Most importantly, you have to believe in yourself. Deep down inside, deep inside your heart, never forget your why. Never forget your what and what you want out of this business. And when your why and your what align, you can do some magical things. I see it time and time again all around the world. There are going to be challenges. I'm reminded one of my favorite quotes is by Winston Churchill. And he said, success is defined by moving failure to failure and never losing your enthusiasm. Does that make sense? You are going to fail in this industry. There are going to be challenges, but what, it, what it's really about is moving from challenge and challenge, failure to failure, never losing that excitement, never losing that passion, that, it, that enthusiasm. The most successful people in this industry, in this company, some of them have been doing it for, you know, six years. They've had ups and downs. They've failed many, many times. You know, people who avoid failure are really just avoiding success. Think about that. If you're not failing, you're not going to be successful. The only difference between these diamonds in the front row, these leaders here, and those of you who just haven't quite got there yet, is they failed more times than you. That's the reality. They have failed more times than you. They've spoken to more people. They've, they've been through the challenges. They've been through the adversity. 
but they have failed more times. It's about working through those failures and never losing the, your enthusiasm. And the other thing is that, you know, you have to go out there and not create followers. Great leaders create more leaders. Leaders don't create followers, they create more leaders. And that's kind of a, a recurring theme of this weekend, that all of you can go out there and empower others to be the change, empower others to be future success stories in this, in this company. I talk about the importance of dreams, and um, I have huge dreams for this company. I have huge dreams for all of you, because I'm just so proud to see all of you continue to build your passion and belief in this company, continue to show up, continue to represent this company, this movement, but the distance between those dreams and your dreams and reality is what we call action, am I right? That's the distance. That's what separates you reaching your dreams and not getting there. It's action. It's taking massive, determined action every single day. Getting outside your comfort zone, talking to more people, you know, sharing your passion for Jeunesse with the world. Successful people take daily action. You're gonna make mistakes, you're gonna have challenges, but the key is to never quit. The only way you won't be successful in this company, the only way you won't be successful in network marketing is if you quit. And that's the biggest problem we have with this industry. Mm. It's, um, it's working through those challenges. It's working together as one team, one family, one Jeanette. It's having the stamina to work through all of the failures and challenges, all of the people that don't see your vision. That's how you're successful in this company. It's gonna take persistence, dedication, and all out passion. I'm gonna ask you one more time. Are you passionate about Jeanette? Yes. Are you passionate about Jeanette? Yes. Let me tell you something, don't just be a picture in the book of Jeunesse, be a part of the story. Get out there, create your success story. Create your success story. All of you have the same potential for greatness. Doesn't matter if you've been in this company one day or been in this company for seven years, all of you have the same potential for growth. And I would encourage you to set realistic goals. If you haven't hit the rank of Sapphire yet, make that a goal. Make that a goal. We've got GPS running right now. We've got all kinds of great things that you can really leverage. How many of you are gonna be at Expo this year in Bangkok? Every single person should be raising your hands. And every single one of you who are not a Sapphire yet, you need to be a Sapphire by Bangkok. Can you commit to that? Yeah. Can you commit to go Sapphire for Expo 2018 Thrive? And am I gonna see all of you in Bangkok, Thailand this year? 10,000 people, we gotta pack out Impact Arena again. Guys, remember that action is the foundational key to all success. Carpe diem, seize the moment, seize the day. Are you ready to seize the moment? Are you ready to take all out massive action? Well, just remember the difference between who you are and who you wanna be is what you do. It's what you do every single day to get better to push yourself to the, to the next goal, the next rank, whatever it is to talk to more people. It's what you do to make today your best day. Are you ready to make today your best day? Yes. Are you ready to make tomorrow your best day? Yes. Guys, it has been my honor to be here back, to, to be with our Jeunesse family from all over Asia Pacific. I really look at today as a huge milestone, a huge turning point. We've gotta go right back into phase one. Some of our markets in this, in this region, we've gotta go and get ready to grind. We gotta be ready to grind to bring new leadership, new blood, new passion into the company. And I believe in each and every one of you that you guys will lead the way. So let's be the change, live your nest. Together, united and empowered, we can create one of the great legacy companies in this industry. Do you believe that? Are you ready to make Jeunesse the number one company in network marketing worldwide? Yes! Guys, if I could get everybody to stand, because I want to feel the energy, I want to feel the passion, one last time, change the industry. So, count of three, I want to hear everybody, one team, one family, one Jeunesse. Three, two, one. One, one team, team, one family, one, one Jeunesse. Three, two, one. One team, one.